Let's now think about the doors and windows that you may wish to put in your project. Now, as we know, there's a very simple uh, selection available and we can load family, load in more types afterwards. But I'm just going to take the windows as an example. Now, I've just loaded in this family here um, with this sort of double split. So we got two windows, but you may well find that they haven't got all the sizes that you would commonly need. For example, these windows, we've got 9, 10 and 12, 10 as the standard heights. But I would actually like a set of windows set at a different height to that. So I'm going to edit the type and duplicate and then rename it to a 1060 high instead and say OK. And then we've got here the rough height, 910, change that to 1060, and then that automatically changes the height and say OK. So now I have that one in my list and I can just repeat that process for a couple of the others. And again, if there's two or three other common types of window that you want to change, maybe there's even some doors where you want to change the sizes like that. And you can just quickly make small edits and have those pre-saved in your template file.